Honestly, I had 30 emails I'm just sorry, going into today. Oh, I lied. I have five emails. Getting 30 or five emails is not at the top of the list for members of University Union. But putting the final touches on Mayfest is. While you may have been wondering all this week about what outfit you're going to wear, the vice president of UU has been thinking about this year's festival a bit longer. A lot of the internal like school things, so getting together like food services, SCPS, um, public safety, etc. happens around a year out just so people can start preparing for that day. But it's not 100% up exactly. to her who performs, it's the students. All of our artists, all of the people that we look at, genres we look at, all come from student feedback because we want to bring who students want to see, so who better to tell us that than the students? We have to break down our budget and make sure that we have enough money for our headliner and then two following acts for direct support and opener. So when we decide on an artist, um, we'll go after them and hopefully confirm, send out an offer. We draft the offer ourselves and then our advisor sends it out on our behalf. Um, and then we'll either confirm or deny or go into negotiations uh, with adjusting money. For students who might not be a huge fan of the performers who are taking the stage. Mayfest is for all of the students, but we understand that not everyone is into music necessarily. So we hope that everyone finds something that they'll enjoy to do at Mayfest, whether it's attending the concert or uh, participating in our activations, uh, taking photos at our photo opportunities like the Mayfest letters and the Mayfest canvas. We want students to be able to interact and have a fun day. Reporting in Syracuse for Unpeeled, I'm Carrie McEnany.